Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just gonna be doing a really informal video. If you follow me on Instagram, you saw that I went to Target today and did quite a bit of damage. So I just wanted to share with you everything I got. It's all completely random, a little of this, a little of that, and I'm just gonna try to go through it all really quickly because it could get really long really fast if I don't. So I'm just gonna share with you everything that I got. First bag. Okay, I'm not gonna go through all this, but I got just a bunch of baby food. This um, Happy Baby Organics and then Organic Teethers. Actually, I think I'm gonna put this in Mason's Easter basket because what do you get a seven month old for from the Easter Bunny? So I think the teething biscuits are gonna go in his basket. Ooh, and I'm excited to try these. These are the Tivana iced teas. Um, you know, you get Tivana at Starbucks. But I picked up the two flavors, the only two flavors that were unsweetened. The other ones sounded really good, but they had like 22 grams of sugar. So I picked up the two unsweetened that have uh, no sugars. This one is the strawberry apple green tea with rose hips and hibiscus. We're going to see if this one's good. It sounds pretty good, but this one sounds really good. It is the Meyer lemon black tea and it has lime peel and lemongrass. This one sounds like it would be really good even if it's not sweet. Strawberry apple to me sounds like it should be sweet, but we're gonna see. If these have zero sugars and a little bit of flavor, I'm really gonna like these all summer long. Next up, we have Tide Pods. I'm finishing up my bag of Tide Pods that are for sports. They're like called Active Fresh Sport. I didn't really like the scent of that one, so I got the Tide with Febreze. This one is Botanical Rain, and I think I'm gonna like this one a lot better. And then a pair of shoes from their new line, A New Day. These are so cute, y'all. I did not need these, but they are a nude pair of sandals, and they are like the faux suede, real strappy on the top. But the thing I love the most is it has a three-inch heel as opposed to a four-inch heel. These are so much more comfortable for me when I'm picking up my kids and and really having to walk around, these are so much more comfortable than a four inch heel and they're really cute on. The straps are a little bit big on my foot. I have a really small ankle, but they're kind of like adjustable. I can pull on them and make them look a little bit better. I don't remember how much these were. I think they were 29, 25 or 29. And I would say they run, I don't know, I buy seven and a half a lot, but normally in like a cheaper brand of shoe, I wear an eight, is that weird? Like higher end brands of shoes, I wear a seven and a half. Cheaper brands, I wear an eight. But I got a seven and a half in these and they fit perfect and have plenty of room. So I say they run just a tad bit big. Well, this isn't really interesting. Oh, also not interesting. I got just a bunch of um, travel size stuff. Travel size, cotton rounds, Neosporin, deodorant, wipes. Um, we're just gonna start traveling here a lot, like coming up on the summertime. So I just stocked up on those. Okay, if you saw my February favorites, I share with you that I love the J.R. Watkins hand soaps. Well, this is my other favorite hand soap from Target, and it is the Method, and it's their new scent, Coconut Water. It smells just like coconut tanning lotion. It smells really good. I keep this in Kaylee's bathroom, and so I got two bottles just to stock up under her sink. Deodorant for me, I love Dove deodorant. Um, eczema cream. Mason has eczema under his chin, poor thing. So... I'm trying this out, the Eucerin Eczema Relief. I'm trying this out before we have to go get a steroid cream. Picked up my first sunscreen of the season because we're about to be outside a whole lot. And even though it's not that hot right now, the sun is still really strong here in Texas. So I got the new Neutrogena Ultra Sheer Face and Body Stick Sunscreen. Now normally I don't buy stick sunscreen, but I like the Ultra Sheer line from Neutrogena and this is brand new this year. It's SPF 70 and um, it smells really good. It's kind of a weird color. Let me see. It really doesn't feel too, too greasy. It was really easy to apply too. So, that, so that's why I bought it. I want to be able to have a quick application on like Kaylee's face and the back of her neck and stuff without her like squirming. I can just rub this on her real quick. And then I just picked up another shade in the Maybelline Matte and Poreless Foundation. Um, I'm about to self tan and I didn't have a darker shade. So I picked up 125 Nude Beige. Hopefully that'll be good. It's really not that dark but it is for me oh yeah that's a pretty beige color and it's not too orangey sometimes i get the wrong like undertone 
and it looks too orange and this is a good beige color. You know you did damage when they pulled out the big bags. Right now I'm organizing. I'm like in the spring cleaning mode around here. So I got these big uh, things of storage baskets. It's from Room Essentials and it comes with, this is a five pack. Where's it at? Oh, there it is. Comes with three of the small cups, one slim and one medium. These are just like a nice, very inexpensive, but like a sturdy plastic bath basket. And then I got this set up as well. It's a three piece. It comes with a small, medium, and large basket. So these are just going to be handy underneath my cabinets and anywhere else. I'm just in the organizing mood. So I got a lot of Easter stuff. It's one of the main things I went to look for because I needed to get my kids Easter baskets and stuff from the Easter Bunny. So I picked up two of the plastic eggs just to use for our Easter egg hunt. And then I got the cutest egg decorating kit. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. They had several different themes, but I got the under the sea type theme. But look, you, you get to dye your Easter eggs and then like dress them up. And it has this little platform here with a palm tree. Oh, so cute. Makes a mermaid, a shark, an octopus, a little scuba diving man, a sunbathing one. This is so stinking adorable and it was only $5. So I cannot wait to make these with Kaylee. She's going to have so much fun. I got the kids Easter baskets. This is Mason's Easter basket. How adorable is this bunny bow tie? And I don't know if you can see, but it has like little plastic whiskers as well. And the back has a bunny tail. So cute. And I love like the boy colors. They have a girl version of this as well. And then for Kaylee, I just got the ones that had pom-poms and says Happy Easter. Her one that she's had since a newborn is just too small. Like she's actually finding eggs now and she needed a big basket. Um, her old one was like this size or smaller from Pottery Barn. But this is kind of like a look-alike of what she had for a lot cheaper. So these are the kids' Easter baskets this year. And then I got stuff from the Easter Bunny. Let's see if I can pull these apart. These little baskets were from the dollar spot. So this is Mason's and this is Kaylee's. I like that it doesn't have a handle on top, so it's perfect to like stuff with toys from the Easter Bunny and they were only $3 a piece, so really cute. And then, like I said, I did not know what to get Mason. He's seven months old for his Easter basket. He's gonna get a, a couple of little books, but they had this um, little spring toy. It's got like a little, carrot teether it has handles inside the stuffed animal and his hands velcro so you can take the teether out but they had this cute rabbit they had a lamb they had a chick they had all kinds of easter themed ones so this is really cute and this feels like a really good teether as well like it has handles he can hold it and then chew on the tip of the carrot so really cute that's going to go in his easter basket hers i got like the big egg full of candy I picked up this in the Easter section. It's a Play-Doh bunny and chick stampers. Um, she loves Play-Doh so much. So this is really cute and something that's not candy because Lord knows she doesn't need a ton of candy. And then I also picked up Kaylee a book. This is the Little Blue Trucks Springtime. We love the Little Blue Truck books and I've never seen the Springtime one. I don't know if it's new, but this one is actually, where's it at? Yeah, this one is actually like a lift the flap book. If you haven't read any of these with your kids, they are so cute. You can get the original little blue truck or just any of them because they are all adorable. Got Mason diapers. These are the Honest Company. They're the brand new print that they came out with. It's Barnyard Babies. They are so cute. Pigs, carrots, they say oink. Have cows, ducks, really, really adorable. I'm such a sucker for the printed Honest Stoppers. They're just so cute. Next, big bag, and this is the last bag. Okay, real quick, I just got Mason some onesies, a little rhinoceros onesie. This one is so soft. Little brother onesie. He's starting to outgrow all the clothes that he has now, so I had to go up a size. Um, I got this little onesie, this little short-sleeved onesie that has lions elephants it looks like zoo animals with these pants how cute are these and has a what is that a lion i don't know 
anyway they go together super cute little outfit I got him a little Easter outfit this one has bunnies and then these adorable little bunny pants go with it oh he's gonna look so cute in this outfit and I got him a little springtime romper this was um, I actually picked this up because Kaylee has a dress that he'll like coordinate with her so I'm gonna dress him alike for church one morning and then for me I got another set of pajamas these are my absolute favorite pajamas and I own just about every color that they have in these pajamas and they came out with this brand new print for spring it's a really cute floral and strap I have the long sleeve and pants sets and these are the shorts and short sleeve sets for the summer they are so soft and um, they're $20 and they are worth it they are so comfortable love these pajamas okay and the last stuff is the most random of the random because it's from the dollar spot so they just get me I got a kids garden tool set I don't know <laughs> I thought Kaylee would enjoy playing in the dirt with these. She does like playing in the dirt, so it comes with a little spade, little shovel, and then this is a rake. But these feel really well made. Like they're actual like metal, a wooden handle, and it was, how much was this? $3. A good little summer toy. Oh, don't ask me why I even got these. They're garden gloves. These are for me. Um, I don't garden. But they're cute, aren't they? How cute are those? Last summer, I actually did need a pair of gloves and I didn't have any because I don't garden. But every now and then, you don't, you don't know when you're gonna need a pair of gloves to do something outside. So now I have some on hand and I did get them because they were only $3. And the last is a stationary set. It comes with a little mini clipboard, a notepad, and a pen. And this was $3 as well. I like that it came with a pen and a little clipboard. I mean, I'm always sucked in by their notepads, but this one actually had, you know, a pen and a clipboard with it for $3 instead of just a notepad. Well, I guess their other ones are only a dollar when you just get the notepad. Oh, cute little pink polka dot pen. And I just love the black and white strap uh, clipboard. And then the notepad says, hello. So that is it for my random Target haul. I hope that you enjoyed this and all of the random goodness that I got from Target. So thank you all so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.